Hello there and welcome to Moxie Books. My name is Vicky Fraser and I am back from my holidays, which were wonderful. And today I've got um, a top tip about how to write about yourself because even though uh, everybody's favourite topic of conversation is themselves, for some reason when we have to sit down and write about ourselves, for example for our about page on our website or our book, it's really difficult. How do we do that? What do we write? Um, too much information, not enough information. So today I've just got three questions for you to ask yourself and keep in mind when you are writing about yourself, maybe for a bio or um, an about page or something else. Question one is, what do people want to know about you? So thinking in the context of your business, what's your background? What experience have you got? Um, why are you a good person for someone to work with? Think about that question. What do people want to know about you? Question the second, is what kind of secrets do people love to discover about you? So for example, for me, one of the secrets that people love to discover about me is that I actually did run away with the circus. Um, I am a trapeze artist, I'm a pole dancer. And the other thing that they love to discover is that I have three miniature sheep um, because I have issues with small, cute, wonky animals. Uh, so that's the second question. What secrets do people love to discover about you? And the third question is, what are people relieved that you understand about them? So for me, that would be people tend to be really relieved that I too suffer from, um, you know, the blank page of doom syndrome. I can sit there for ages and stare at a blank page and just be like, I don't know what to do. Um, just because I'm a writer doesn't mean that I have this magical ability to overcome the problems that every writer faces. So what are people Third question, what are people relieved to um, discover that you understand about them? That's a really good start, a really good basis for you to build your about page um, and build on the information that people want to know about you whilst telling your story as well. And you can do that in a bunch of ways. You can have like an FAQ page or you can have like a bunch of facts about yourself or you can simply tell it as a narrative story. There's loads of different options for you and there really is no right or wrong answer. It's all about thinking about what people want to know, what's relevant to them um, and, then, and then keeping that in mind. So I hope that helps when you come to write about yourself and you're thinking, oh, it's really painful, I don't want to. And if this is the kind of thing that you do struggle with and you could do with a bit of accountability, a bit of help, maybe you want to ask me a question face to face, come and join my power hour. It's moxiebooks.co.uk forward slash power hour. And I've also got a challenge running at the moment, it's starting next week. Um, it's free five day challenge, come and join me. Um, the link is below in the comments um, or in the notes for this video. Uh, come along, see how you can bust the blank page of doom, whether it's writing about yourself or something else. And I'll be back on Friday with a Flamingo Friday. Take care, bye.